marching in as midshipmen, leaving as commissioned officers. Happy graduation day to the class of 2014 at the U.S. Naval Academy. You know, getting through four years at the prestigious academy is a grueling task, oh, both yeah. mentally and physically. Yeah. But members of today's graduating class had a chance to celebrate their hard work before embarking on their new careers and lives. Their send off today was from Defense Secretary Chuck Hagel. Here's 11 News reporter Jennifer Franciotti. You couldn't ask for a better day out here at the stadium. 1,068 graduates in a ceremony that marked the return of the Blue Angels. A spectacular sight and a perfect start to the Memorial Day weekend here at the U.S. Navy Marine Corps Stadium. The graduating class of 2014 walks down the aisle for the moment they've worked hard for for the last four years. It's just the culmination of four long years of hard work and also the culmination of so many that supported us as well. I chose to come to the Naval Academy because I, I lost my uncle in 9-11. He was uh, in the South Tower and he was really my, my motivation for service to our country. And my high school football coach who was uh, a Marine uh, enlisted man, he was, he was truly inspirational in, in wanting me to come here. And uh, I found tremendous pride in, in doing this and I've always felt that I've, I've kind of been the one out in front uh, even in high school and this was truly the next progression for me. It's been a long time coming. Just it's building up to this point and now it's like kind of like finally here so it's kind of just like wow it's like I can't believe I'm graduating finally it's certainly an emotional day for families who stood by their sons and daughters the emotions makes emotions happy um, he did all the hard work we did all the tears all the cheering all the phone calls he was just amazing when I first came in that day I was asking myself you know is this really what I want to do and I'm not asking about myself today but I st it still hasn't hit me that I'm graduating, so it's, there's that unknown as well. Most of the graduates will go on to serve as commission officers in the Navy. 265 are now Marines, ready to defend our country. But before they start their service, some advice from the Secretary of Defense. Be humble. Stay humble. By virtue of your unique experience here at the Naval Academy, you have much, much to be proud of. And confident about. And after a day of celebrating with family and friends, these young men and women will go on to serve a minimum of a five year commitment with the U.S. Navy and the Marines. Here in Annapolis, Jennifer Franciati, WBAL TV 11 News. Go Navy!